points. They've got points nine of their last 10 is Bridgeport. No score between the first place Bears and the Islanders. Through center, Scarp also weaves his way past Maggio, then trying to split Fulp and Savigny. And that door closed as he neared the net. All ties Thompson on for Otto Koivula, and he'll send it ahead to his Hakov, who drives the net. Got a shot off, he scores! And the celebration through the neutral zone, Ruslan is Hakov has given the Islanders the lead. Koivala stretched it to his hock off. He caught in, lowering his shoulder. Couldn't get a shot off as he passed through the top of the crease. But he turned on the forehand and lifted one up over the right shoulder of Clay Stevenson. He went east to west on the drive to the crease. Only got the shot off by the time he reached the bottom of the circle. And he beats the near side. Ruslan Izakov, the all-star with his team leading 13th goal. Back to Scarbosa. He curls right wing wall, leaves it for Prisky. Prisky, bottom of the right circle, banks it behind the net. Centering pass, squirts through Scarbosa. Deep slot. Here's Amin Oktel to the left side. Slam shot, they score! Chase Prisky, and we're tied with 3.36 to go in the third. Well, the Bears just kept pressing, and they score on their 27th shot of the afternoon. The first one that leaks through Tekin in comes with 3.36 to go. Sivan Mirosnichenko, the 19-year-old rookie for the Bears, has made his NHL debut this season. In on the forehand, he scores. Now Tekin in dropped down in time, but Mirosnichenko found an opening. And First shot of this shootout goes in. The Bears have the advantage. And here comes William Dufour. Dufour, the first shooter for the Islanders in a shootout this season. He'll take it wide right. In on the forehand, shoots and scores! Dufour went low on Stevenson. It redirected off of his body and in. He got a little piece of it, but not nearly enough. And William Dufour has tied it through the first round of this shootout. Joe Snively is up next for the Bears. Third shootout attempt of the season. He's one for two and quickly and again goes low on Tikkanen and scores. Slides it underneath the six foot eight net binder and no question that's what the Bears are trying to do is go low in the shootout and force the six foot eight goalie to try to get low quickly. Which is a lot harder said or done than said, here is, uh, is Hakov who's in on the left side, forehand. He's waiting very slowly as Hakov back in, forehand, he scores! What a move for his Hakov. He kept the puck moving forward the whole way and he scores to make it a tie shootout, 2-2 two, two through two. Everybody with a shot has a goal as Hakov extremely slowly finished on the forehand. And now quite the opposite, darting in with a head of speed. It is Scarbosa and a low shot's kicked away. In a flash, Scarbosa right at Tikkanen. And he was not going to get it that time. A right pad save by Tikkanen. And it's Carson Kuhlman on the ice. Kuhlman, he could win it here for the Islanders with the goal. Carson Kuhlman, the win on his stick. The backhand, oh, what a save! Getting the blocker in the stick side out. Big time save for Clay Stevenson who keeps the shootout going. Through three rounds, we're still tied at two apiece. pierre Dubé for the Bears. The leading goal scorer for her. She's two for three in shootouts this year. And quickly in on Tekin and Dubé shot shrugged away. Blocker saved, Tekin in two for four now in this shootout. Dubé can't get it to go, and Otto Koivula can end it. Otto Koivula had the primary assist on the his Hakov goal in the third. Now he could win it. Koivula in quickly. In a flash and a shot missed the left post. He pumped it wide, and we're still headed. Two more rounds, at least to a fifth round. It is 2-2 two, two through four, and the Bears looking to retake the lead in the shootout here. It'll be Ethan Frank, now a two-time AHL All-Star. Former leading scorer in the NCAA, Ethan Frank on the forehand. The righties in, drags it, he lost the puck, never got a shot off. 
Head aggressive, Tekin in, came out at the top of the crease to brush it off the stick of Frank. We're headed back the other way, and here is Matt Maggio, his first pro shootout attempt. Matt Maggio with eight points on the year. The former OHL most outstanding player. The rookie is in, Maggio on the forehand. The righty shoots low, and he got it! It just trickled in.